Josh, are you rolling? Okay, cool. Okay, so here we are on Campus Commons where we just helped, helped set up this awesome display with Justice for All. They're a national pro-life group and this is David Lee, the head of the organization, and he's gonna tell us a little bit about them. So real quick, what's JFA? Hey Hannah, good to be here. Good. Justice for All trains thousands of students to make abortion unthinkable for millions, we hope, one student at a time. And how do you do that? We set up exhibits like this for a two-day outreach in which students like these learn to tell the truth about abortion to their campus. Cool. You got anything else besides this? We actually use this handheld exhibit brochure, which is a replica of the large one, cool. in which they can use to also share it with their family, friends, and acquaintances. Can I answer your question? You bet. See? <laughs> students are already coming up and asking their questions. Shut the f And giving their opinions, which I will be editing out. But you see, it's already really effective well, because it... Miss McElroy, a week hardly goes by without our paths and swords crossing. Yet again, I need to ask you to stop what you're doing. Filming? <laughs> Clever. No. <laughs> All of you, stop what you're doing and get this display. Move it. Move it? <laughs> to where? Behind the student union. Behind... The... But nobody can see it there. Well, precisely. This display is emotionally harassing, offensive, and potentially disruptive. And if you don't move it, there will be punishment. That's not right. This just isn't right. Well, I appreciate your sentiments, Miss McElroy. However, I am paid to decide what is right for this student body to see and hear. Now get a move on. So that's it. I'm going to have to do something in contact that legal group that I talked to you about a few web posts ago, um, the Alliance Defense Fund, because there's no way what the school is doing to us is legal. And I'm sorry if I'm emotionally overreacting, but there's more to the story than just that. You know, a lot more. Just stay here, Josh, and I'll figure something out. Shame on you. You should all be ashamed. Did you ever stop to think that you might be hurting someone by spreading this kind of fear? Uh, we're not spreading fear. And we're not trying to hurt anyone. Well, you are. And some girl's not going to get help because of you. It's a woman's decision what to do with her body, not your decision. It's her choice. Not the baby's choice. Don't say that! <laughs> You have no idea what I'm going through. How dare you? How dare you? Um, you're right. I have no idea what you're going through. But I did have an abortion at 16. And trust me, the pain and the regret is greater than you will ever imagine. Don't do this. Please. She didn't go through with it. She's going to keep the baby, and we're going to support her and help her. That's why I wanted to start the Pro Life Club. And that's why I'm going to keep pushing to change these unfair policies on this campus. So, until next time, see you later.